Hello everyone, good morning. It's another day in Orlando for us. We are heading to Volcano Bay. Um, so we, I woke up about quarter past seven. Um, the Man United game started at half seven, so I watched that in the room. The plan was for the kids to have a lay-in, but as soon as I turned the TV on, they all woke up. Yeah, because so, I heard that the TV on. Yeah. I tried to lower it down as quickly as I could, but it comes on quite loud. So, yeah, that's, um, that's our morning. Charlie popped to McDonald's and got us breakfast. I come to $22, I think it was. She got a few extra drinks this time. Um, but yeah, we're just heading to the car now. We did hear on, well, on the Facebook group that we're on, it's Orlando time. Apparently yesterday, in a few days, um, Volcano Bay's been sort of at capacity around half 10. It's half nine now. So we're gonna get in the car, scoot over to um, Volcano Bay, hopefully get in. We're only gonna stay there for a few hours. Um, we're gonna come out of there around lunchtime and go and have lunch somewhere else. Um, just because it's a bit expensive in the park and we wanna to go to the outlets at the top and then spend a few hours there. And then we may go and feed the alligators um, at the mini golf and then have something to eat. <clears throat> and then we're gonna try and go swim, swimming in our hotel a bit later because we couldn't do it last night. So that's the plan. So. Charlie's just gone up because this one, been asking her for two hours to get ready and she forgets everything when we leave the door. So we have to head back. So we are, yeah, just at the car now and we're gonna head to Volcano Bay. Okay, so you're probably wondering why I put a clip in of us arriving back at our hotel. Um, so we've decided to not go Volcano Bay. We got to sort of the entrance to Universal, like the car park bit, and it was absolutely rammed. As I mentioned earlier, it was closed by half 10, so we're only, we were only planning on staying there for a couple of hours anyway, so what we've decided to do now is come back to our hotel and go swimming here for a couple of hours. And then I think we might go swimming like this. And then we're gonna go back swimming later on this evening. Paige wants to do an evening swim. Yeah. So um, yeah, that's our plan. We're gonna, um, yeah, stay here for a couple of hours and then we're gonna go and give the kids some lunch somewhere um somewhere on the drive and then we're gonna go to the outlets to do some more shopping so we'll see you guys very soon so we're just at the pool um we've just got out we're just drying ourselves off that's why i've got this towel over my head to try and get the sun off it i actually lost my cap the other day so i haven't got a, a cap so might try and look for one today at the outlets um something happened in the pool that we didn't really like so you know, a little boy i think Done the toilet, not in the water, but it ended up all up his back and everything. And then the parents have decided to wash him and everything on the side, which is fine. But then they've got in the pool and washed all their hands, which seems absolutely disgusting. Um, yeah, it wasn't the best. And it was uh, an English family as well, so um, it doesn't give us a good name. So we have got out the water, we are drying ourselves off. We're gonna go up to the room, get changed. And then um, I think we're gonna go to Chickerfield, which is just down the road from our hotel. Um, me and Charlie are not gonna get anything, but gonna give the kids lunch. And then we're gonna make our way to the outlets. I'm gonna, um, yeah, as I mentioned, look for a cap. I do wanna try and buy a pair of trainers today. I'm gonna look in Under Armour, because they're quite cheap in there. I'll have a look in Nike and Adidas as well. So, um, but yeah, that's it at the minute. We've been at the pool. About an hour and a half. Um, it's quite hot today. As you can see, I'm covering my head. But um, Paige is just getting changed in the changing rooms down here. And then I'm gonna I'm gonna go up to the room and get changed. It's just easier. Yeah, that's it. So we'll see you guys at Chickerfield. Okay, so we're just in Chickerfield. We've just ordered our food. Paige is just getting some straws and all that. Teddy and um, Charlie are just here. We just said that like how clean it is in here for a fast food restaurant. Good thing is they give you food to you. This is what we ordered. So we got a chicken sandwich uh, with fries, dots of pepper. We got a kids uh, happy like kids meal, nugget, mac and cheese, and apple juice. We've got a fruit cup, and we got two milkshakes as well. But it's um it's so clean. In it. Look at it. It's just like you order up there, and then you um come and sit down, bring this with you, and then they come and deliver your food to you. 
Jam They've just picked up some strawberry jam. Take them back to our room. Teddy can have them in the morning with breakfast. Okay, so we've just got our sandwich. So me and Paige have gone for a chicken burger. We're sharing it. We got chips. Paige has got some Chick-fil-A sauce. I've got some Polynesian sauce. Teddy's got cheesy pasta with fruit and chicken nuggets. And we've got two strawberry milkshakes. Well, one strawberry milkshake and one vanilla milkshake as well. Okay, so we just got Teddy a ice cream cone and he is happy. Look at him. Look at him. Bigger than his face. Teddy, how does it taste? Yummy. Yeah. Very nice. Should I take some of the ice cream off? Might need to take some off. Yeah, let me take some ice cream off. Oh no, no, you can't touch it. No. Oh, don't give me them eyes. Give me them eyes. Hi guys. So we've just got in the car from our lunch. Really nice lunch, that. Really nice chicken sandwich. Milkshakes are lovely in there. If you do go there, highly recommend the milkshake. Uh, Teddy had an ice cream in there. Um, we're just going to leave here now. We're going to head to the outlets at the top of International Drive. When I say top, it's not the Sea World end, it's the other end. Um, we're going to have a look around there. Teddy's going to have a little nap. Um, I need to go in the Under Armour just before the outlets um, to take some shorts back that I bought that were too small. Um, but yeah, we're going to make our way there and then um, go and spend some more money probably. Okay, so it's half one now. We've spent the last half an hour trying to find a car space. It is absolutely rammed here. Like there's people parking on the sidewall. There's just, I've never seen it this bad here before. We had to ask someone that was walking about to see a car if they're leaving, and luckily they were. So then we managed to get a space, so. But it's, oh, it's an absolute chocolate. There's like 50 cars trying to find space. Yeah, it's, it's ridiculous. So we're at the outlets now. Time to spend some money. Teddy's yeah. just gonna go to sleep. Well, he's fighting it, but he's gonna go to sleep. He moans that he doesn't wanna go to sleep and then he drifts off and he's like, just knocks himself out. So, yeah, we're gonna go spend some money and we'll speak to you guys soon. Done some shopping, bought quite a lot of stuff. Again, we'll show you show you guys when we get back. Paige just got herself a sweet, it's a sour apple. Super sour spray airhead. Yeah, tastes absolutely disgusting. Lovely. We've got two lollies in there, maybe a dollar each, but they're for Make-A-Wish Foundation. So um, yeah, we know we know about that charity, so we thought we'd buy those. One for Teddy, one for Paige. Um, we're just heading back to our car now. Um, we are going to go back to our hotel quickly, just drop the fins that we got back. And then I think we're going to go and feed the um, crocodiles, or the alligators, and then make our way to something to eat. Time's half three at the moment. Okay, so we've just stopped off at International Drive. Um, just before we go back to the hotel, we're um, just going to feed the alligators. Um, we're at the, what one is this one? It's Congo. Congo, it's just by Four Point Sheraton. Yeah, Congo, Congo River. Um, what else we got to get back at the hotel? Uh, some ointment, because Paige had some drunk rice before we got here. Yeah, we showed that on our travel yeah. there. And then um, Teddy has woke up this morning with a bit of a sticky eye. So luckily I did buy an extra chew um, in case one of us caught it anyway. Obviously yeah. that's not from Paige, but um, yeah, so we're going to go back and get that stuff and start that in the dryer. So we're going to, yeah, feed the alligators and we'll show you how it goes. Okay, so we're just watching them catch the gators because they're actually moving them, I think. So I think they're getting a bit big for this Mommy. area. Mommy. So they're going to take them... They're gonna take them. Sorry if you get splashed. No, sorry. <laughs> so they're trying to. Um, yeah. Oh, they want them out. They're gonna get them out. Look at them. They want to get out. They want to run away. Okay, so the guys are still collecting them. Teddy actually just got to stroke one. They gave. They put his towel through the the fence bit here and Teddy stroked him. <laughs> and this lady's trying to catch her first one, I think. Yes, 
Okay, so we're just leaving the Congo River um, alligate feeding. Uh, we didn't, we paid to feed them, but they'd only just put the baby ones in. They weren't used to feeding and they weren't accepting any food that we were giving them. So they're still putting baby yeah. ones in the ones, the bits that I recorded where the big ones were, they're now putting baby ones in there. So they're not going to be feeding yet. They don't know what they've got to do. And so it's all new to them. So, um, yeah bit of a waste of money because they didn't actually jump up for the food but Teddy got to touch the alligator so he's happy with that and then um yeah he, he got to see the alligators anyway so that was good so we're just heading back to our hotel now gonna go and get the drops and then drop our stuff back and then go to eat don't know where we're going yet so we'll let you know wherever we choose to okay so we are gonna be going into the restaurant BJ's brew house. So we went in here in May and we really enjoyed it. The only problem with this one on Ancestral Drive, it was um service wasn't the greatest, so we'll see. So we've got Teddy here. Teddy, you can show everyone your eye. Look, he's got a little bit of eye there, look, you see his eye? Oh poor little thing. No, no, no. We just put some drops in it. That didn't hurt him. So this is the jalapeno burger. Charlie got sweet potato fries instead of normal chips. Teddy got the penny pasta uh, with marinara sauce, with uh, broccoli and apple sauce. Paige got Kraft mac and cheese, apple sauce and fruit pot. And then I had the brisket and brisket and bacon burger with chips as well. Looks really, really nice. Okay, so we just got some of their bazooki cookies, I think they're called. So Paige got an Oreo. Oreo one, wasn't it? Yes. It's absolutely boiling. Wait a minute, Charlie's just stuffing something in my face. <laughs> Teddy got the salted caramel one. Mm. Charlie got, got this, this big share. monster one. And Daddy got nothing. I got nothing. Mummy? Daddy got nothing. No, you got something. Mummy got one. Daddy ain't got nothing. He'll mommy. share with Mummy. He'll have some of yours and mine. Mummy got one. Mummy got one. Mummy got one. Hi, guys. We've just got out of our restaurant bj brew house uh, we just popped into walgreens which is just in that building there um hey you got some sweets you can get three for five yeah you got three boxes for five dollars they're small ones but they're good sizes for the kids um teddy got some hot wheel cars they were only seven dollars for five so yeah he's got um hot wheel spins at home we're actually buying him stuff for his birthday for hot wheels so he'll be able to use them but yeah, we're just going to make our way back to our hotel now. It's 6.30, so we're going to be back nice and early. We're just back at our hotel room now. We got back here just after 7, I think it was. So, um, yeah, we've had an early night tonight. Charlie's not feeling too good. She's got a cold, she thinks. Teddy's got his eye problem. So, we're expecting that to be worse tomorrow. We're hoping Charlie's better tomorrow. Because we've got a busy day tomorrow. Um, just wanted to go through what we'd spent today. So for breakfast, we spent, I think it was about £18. For lunch, we spent about £24, I think it was. Bits and bops, we've not really spent much today, really, to be honest. I'd say probably £20, £30. Um, yeah, not too much, to be honest. Um, for dinner, we our meal came to $71, which, I don't know, is about £55, £55, £60, I think it is, so... Um, very nice that meal actually, really enjoyed that and that was probably one of the best burgers I've had in Florida I would say so um, if you are going there, highly recommend the brisket and bacon burger um, regarding tomorrow we have got a very very busy day tomorrow uh, it's our final day at Disney and we're doing three parts yes, three parts we are going Hollywood Studios, first thing in the morning. We're going to do Mickey's Runaway Train. We're then going to go and do um, Tower of Terror. Hopefully do that twice. Well, Paige can. We'll do Child Swap. Then we're going to watch the Frozen show. 
and then I think we're going to leave there, depending on what the time is, and go to Epcot. We can't get into Epcot till half one, two o'clock, I think it is. So we're going to go and do that. Then from there, we're going to go to, we're going to do the Easter Egg Trail uh, that Epcot are doing. So we've got to walk around the whole world. And then we're going to come away from Disney. We're going to go, we may come back to the hotel for a bit. We're going to have some dinner somewhere. We may go Disney Springs. And then we're going to go to Magic Kingdom on the night. And we're going to watch the fireworks for the last time. So it's a very, very busy day. I've got the kids. The kids are going mad at the minute. They're having a battle. Teddy, Teddy's just a nut, seriously. He really does. He does test her nerves, I tell you. He is really <laughs> trying to push her. Um, he keeps trying to take her iPad. So um, I'm going to finish the vlog there because they're going to be a domestic in a minute with these two. So um, yeah, tomorrow three parts. Hell of a busy day. My feet are going to be knackered out of it. Let us know in the comments how many steps you actually think we're going to do. I'm going to say 26,000, which is probably about 12, 13 miles, I think it is. So it's going to be a busy day. So in the comments, let us know how many steps you think we're going to be doing. And we'll, we'll update the vlog once we know how many we've done. So, um, yeah, I'm going to finish the vlog there. Hope you've enjoyed it. It's been a short vlog today. Uh, I haven't really done too much, to be honest. So um, we was going to go Volcano Bay. We went to the pool. And, yeah, we just had a sort of resting time, really. So I hope you've enjoyed the vlog. If you have, please give us a thumbs up. If you've not yet subscribed to the channel, then please do. It does help the channel grow. If you're not yet following us on Instagram, then please do as well. Links are below in the description. But, yeah, hope you've enjoyed watching. And we will see you for a very busy day tomorrow.